This is Raptors Rundown, a time to chill. Basketball fans, Akil Augustine coming with you from the 300 level of Scotiabank Arena, holding court for Raps Rundown. Sunday afternoon, your Toronto Raptors have a hot date with the Brooklyn Nets. If you're in the building, make some noise. If you're at home watching, support the boys. Shout out to this young girl who rocked a Delano Banton costume for Halloween. She won Halloween hands down. The Prime Minister better have called her. On another note, you like my jacket? Well, you can get yours. This is the collaboration between Peace Collective and the Toronto Raptors and Coors Light. You can get it at shipandsip.ca. Last but definitely not least, do you know a creator? Are you a creative? Then you're gonna wanna know the lowdown on the brand new year we're kicking off for the Toronto Raptors Welcome Toronto Creators Program. And I've got all the information right after this. Do you require stifling defense? Call Delano and Barnes, rookies who get the job done. Delano and Barnes. Toronto, the future is watching. So back in 2018, the Toronto Raptors created the Welcome Toronto program. It was originally based around community initiatives and cultural programming. In 2021, they expanded the program to focus on 16 to 29 year old BIPOC artists, giving them creative opportunities and the spotlight. So the Toronto Raptors return, Welcome Toronto returns with its growing alumni of Julius, Trey and Hannah, and they will serve as ambassadors and mentors for the next crop. This year will be inspired by the theme, Moments Mixtape. Our three chosen artists will each have their own Welcome Toronto night dedicated to spotlighting their story and their art under the banner of our brand new 2021-22 City Edition uniforms. Applications opens the week of November 29th. All right, guys, it's time for Ask an Expert. This week, we have none other than the newest member of the broadcast team, Alvin Williams, Raptor legend. And Paper Dingwall wants to know, Alvin, you're in the booth now. How's it different? How's the experience been? Hey, this is Alvin Williams. I'm, uh, I'm sitting here just thinking about how I actually feel working next to Matt Devlin and calling the games, the Toronto Raptors games. And it's, it's an unbelievable feeling. It's something where I've been a part of the Raptor, the Toronto, and the Canadian community, sports community for years. So you get an opportunity to call the games and be a part of the action, traveling with the team. It's, I don't know if it's a dream come true, but it's something that's very special to me. So I'm feeling good. I'm excited to call more games and be a part of the Raptors' success and, and, and watching this young team grow with all the talent. So I'm happy, I'm excited, I'm thrilled, and I feel like I'm where I'm supposed to be back in Toronto. 